Convergence pulls the DC multiverse together from every nook, cranny, time, and space, and we can't wait to see some long-lost friends. This is the DC All Access Top 10 DC Characters Returning in Convergence. First up is kick-ass former GCPD Detective Renee Montoya as The Question. During Ed Brubaker and Greg Rucka's run on Gotham Central, Two-Face falls in love with Montoya and courts her in the worst way possible by outing her as a lesbian and framing her for murder. Now in Convergence, The Question is teaming up with Two-Face. We can't wait to be a fly on the wall of that awkward reunion. The dynamic duo of Golden Age Superman and Power Girl nabs are number nine. The two reunited back during Infinite Crisis, but Superman died, so their relationship was short-lived. Seeing the original 1938 Superman team up with his cousin in Convergence Action Comics will be a family reunion nearly a decade in the making. Number eight is the return of a fan-favorite Justice League international team. We love this quirky supergroup. We're sure to get some belly-busting Blue Beetle blah ha and hopefully a Chaco or two to manage Martian Manhunter's mood. Our number seven is the immensely powerful Parallax, Hal Jordan. In Convergence Green Lantern Parallax, Kyle Rayner, my favorite, visits Hal Jordan, who believes he wiped out the entire Green Lantern Corps. The two become BFFs as Kyle tries to save Hal from Parallax, and I think the fan fiction is already writing itself. Next up, we get to see the relaunch of the benchmark Legion of Superheroes team. Superboy teams up with classic members of the Legion like Ultra Boy, Lightning Lass, and Invisible Kid to take on the Atomic Knights and their giant Dalmatians. If there's a god, there will be 101 of them. 80s era Green Arrow, Bullseyes are number five, and he'll meet his son Connor Hawk for the first time in Convergence. This is street tough, I don't need no mask, Oliver Queen, who rocked the Van Dyke beard and ditched his trademark trick arrows for classic wood shafts and arrowheads. We're totally wigging out to the max, man. Weep no more for the absence of Wally West as the Flash in DC continuity, because Convergence marks his triumphant return alongside his two super-powered kids, Jay and Iris. Plus, Wally teams up with a speedster from the zoo crew, a turtle named Fastback. You heard me, a turtle speedster. Number three is the ultimate shipper fantasy. Nightwing and Oracle have had an on-again, off-again romance ever since they became costume superheroes. Writer Gail Simone reignites their romance in Convergence Nightwing Oracle, and we'll see Barbara and Dick give Lois and Clark a run for their money as top DC couple. I love me some Aura Wing. Our number two marks the return of the original super team in comics, the Justice Society. The Golden Age versions of our favorite characters are back, including Jay Garrick as The Flash and Alan Scott as Green Lantern. The team puts their bridge game on hold to come out of retirement and take on the forces of the Quad universe. And finally, our number one is the new Teen Titans. This is truly the Teen Titans in top form. Marv Wolfman, who made the team uber popular in the 80s, is back to write new adventures for Nightwing, Starfire, Cyborg, and the rest. Titans together! Let us know in the comments what other characters you're excited to see in action over the next two months. And for some pre-convergence team adventures, check out New Teen Titans Volume 1 and Just Society Volume 1. And remember to subscribe for more of the Convergence coverage that you crave. Plus, it is free, and free makes everything better.